In this video, I'm going to be giving you 10 essential key tips to master the Vandal in under 2 minutes. This way, you can finally stop being ass dying to shitty boosted diamond players and finally get that rank you want, since you'll be going around like a madman, one-tapping monkeys left and right. First of all, let's get the obvious and easy tips out of the way. You need to stop spraying. The spray patterns in this game in general is absolute garbage. With the Vandal, your first 7 bullets will go up and the rest will be random. Instead, you need to be extremely disciplined. Burst fire and tap fire at long distances, and always aim at the head. To do this, you will need to hop into deathmatch and practice only counter strafing. On all the Valorant maps, there are features on the walls that will help you figure out if your crosshair is on head level. Number four, let's talk about positioning and distances. If the enemy is located within zero to five meters, you can spray and run on gun no problem. You wouldn't want to really strafe here. Five to 15 meters, I recommend two tap bursts. You can strafe, but spraying here isn't so bad, depending on the positioning of you and the enemy. 15 to 50 meters, you should be strafing, only aiming for the head and eliminating spraying as much as possible. Anything above 50 meters and you should be using ADS, aim down sights. The reason for this is because at 50 meters or more, the first bullet accuracy of the Vandal drops to 57%. This leads me on to my next tip. On eco rounds, you should treat your Vandal as an op, since at close range, stingers and shotguns will demolish you. You need to be comfortable taking long range fights, since this will give you advantage over phantom users. Furthermore, you need to pre-fire common held angles because you have the one-shot ability. If you don't know what I mean, just look at the examples I'm showing right here. Number 9. Never ever ever spray through smokes while using this gun. You will get killed almost 75% of the time. The reason for this is because they can see your bullet tracers. But not only that, the Vandal spray is worse and slower compared to the Phantom, so you should only be doing it if you have no other option and there's a guy really close to your smoke. Finally, stay calm and stop panicking. When placed in high stress situations like intense comp matches, you will usually find yourself going back into your old habits of crouch spraying everywhere. When using this gun, if you find yourself peeking into multiple people, most likely you're going to end up dead, so what you want to do is just try to take one out with a burst fire. And in your mind, you should be ready to strafe and flick onto the other opponents. The reason I mention this is because it's a much better option than spraying everywhere. So there you have it, 10 tips to master the Vandal to help you escape ELO hell. Please subscribe before the landlord shows up, I'm begging you, they are about to kill you.